You know what's worse than a bell? A shiny bell! Oh my god, look at the shinies. Oh my god. Hello everyone, my name is Xenobolt. Welcome back to Let's Play TLOZTP, The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. I don't know why I did its initials this time, but you know why not? Now let's head over in here. Let me crack my knuckles, because why not? And we got 500 rupees short, so we'll donate 439. Four. One, two, three. No. We're supposed to go up to nine. There we go. We are 61 rupees short. Cool. Time to go grind for some rupees, because, you know, why not? And yeah. I know what you're thinking, what are we doing in the Goron Mines? But there's a treasure chest we couldn't get before that I thought we'd get now. Which is 50 rupees, which will help us get to 61, because I already got 11. Problem is, is I have to go all the way out, and here's 50 rupees. Yay. Never actually gotten that treasure chest before, I just knew it was there. And I gotta go all the way back, don't I? Yes, I do. Will I warp? No. That sucks. Well, I'll meet you back at CAC. Okay, there's a reason why I'm not a speedrunner. That took... I took so long getting out of there, I mean. Man, that took forever. Anyways, we can come in here, and we can... Donate our 61s of rupees. Now that we have them. Yes. One, two, three, four, five, six... Even though that's over the amount I need to don't... Oh, wait, no, it wasn't. It was 61. Those corrupt price-gouging shops in Castletown are officially on notice. Soon they will rule. Oh, evil baby, you sound so corrupt. You shouldn't be saying anyone else is corrupt. You're so corrupt. Soon they will rue the day. I mean, that just sounds like you're a jerk, evil baby. Then again, you are the evil baby of the land. Land Hyrule. Now, if we come back in here... We now have only 2,000 uh, left before we reach our goal for financing a store in Castletown. Please bring us, help us bring relief. Nah. That's a lot to do. Spend 1,000 to get 2,000. What if we can make it lower? And getting a heart piece to two. What if we could do that? Well, don't look further than this guy. He'll help us out. He'll help us out! That was so... jeez. You made a donation, did you not? Tell me, do my young... Do you know my young one in Castletown? Perhaps you could look in on him for me, my brother. Okay. Let's warp there. I forgot about that. Thanks, Midna. Now we'll hide behind our little sign. Hugging the wall, let's go to Castletown. And there's the warp. And it's a little night time, a little night, a little night. Which means we might have to cut that off soon because I won't be able to do it during night time. Which means we can get the last two posed this video too, but we won't be able to uh, do, do, you know, what, what do we need to do? Listen, I think I, I think I only have two posts left. Am I missing any? I don't think so. Huh. This is an interesting question. Questions with Xenobolt. This way, this way, this way. Let's go this way. Okay, uh, we need to get to West Castletown, don't we? Yes, we do. We need to go this way, there's lots and lots of soldiers and people. All them good people. Now, we haven't actually really been this way yet, so we are going to go this way so we can explore this way and do this way. And, jeez, I dropped my nunchuck. My nunchuck? It's, 
it's a guy named Chuck who's numb. This way. And out my ear. Okay. Uh, so I'm sorry with my stupid sounds. I apologize greatly. Being stupid. Come on, har. Come in har. And we got to go on. Oh, I do not feel like doing a thing. Now the bridge is fixed, but my body feels terrible. I just cannot go look for stuff to sell. You know, all I really need is to shower myself with some poppin' hot spring water to get my back to feeling normal. Now we can go over there and, and talk to him, and he'll give us some spring water to do that. But we have two posts to take care of, too. Now, a little spoiler, once you do that, the you automatically then can only need 200 rupees rather than 2,000, which it, it's a lot more manageable, that's for sure. So don't stop looking for money. In fact, these guys will give us money. If they'll be kind, they'll give us money. No, you'll give us arrows instead. You'll shoot us like a butt face. You know what? You're a butt. How does that, how does that feel that I called you something where poop comes out of it? Then again, I'm something where poop comes out of because I have a... Uh, never mind. That was dumb. I'm sorry. Now, once it becomes nighttime, we have a Poe. That was kind of convenient, the timing of that. Let's take your Poe. And, yeah, there we go, Poe Soul. Now we warp because we can get the second Poe. Now we can't actually do the... uh. That's gonna be the best warp point for this last Poe, which I will meet you to where we will need to be for this last Poe. Okay, we're close to where we need to be for this, the final Poe we can get right now. Um, what we need is bomb arrows. No, I, this needs to be set first, then we can do bomb arrows. There we go. We got a pull up there, but we can, we'll need to destroy these. That's it. We can get our claw shot out. Almost hit hook shot once more. And there's the hook shot panel. Right, come on. We can hook shot up, claw shot up here. And th that time I did say claw shot. Or hook shot, I mean. Jeez. I don't think it did, uh... That's a problem that... Yeah, I'm gonna have to use my lantern real quick so I can see... There we go. Yeah, I couldn't see the cl claw shock uh, panel, so... It's very helpful that I can do that. You know, I wonder if he'll disappear at the lantern. Because <laughs> it is light, and he doesn't do well with light, and there's also a... There's also a treasure chest over there, which is nice, and there's a dick cavern up here, too. Dick cavern. Like how I said I like him from the sound. There you go. Hi, Poe. How are you today? No. I do not want to go to the ledge, Poe. Eager Alan Poe. I'm pretty sure I butchered his name. Crap, I'm about to die. Go. Watch out for the ledge, and let's take his Poe! Thank you! Now let's, we're going to do this stuff real quick, and then I'm going to end off the video. This is a 50 rupees, which is nice, because we need it already for the, uh, for the, uh, 200 rupee donation. This is a dick cavern in this circle. Like an alien, one of those, you know, alien circles in the farms. Kind of cool. Oh my goodness, there's so many, so much, so much ice. I think I'm gonna use the Great Fairy's Tears so I don't die. Get some power ups as well. And oh my god, Link is orange and he's not because I immediately got hit anymore. I, uh, it's so cool how he's orange. We got these guys. Spin attack 
rapes everything. Where'd you go? Okay, are you going to... There we go. And he's dead. Let's take this rupee, because that would be helpful. And there's a treasure chest, which... I don't remember. I think it's 100 rupees or a heart piece. I'm kind of hoping it's 100 rupees, actually, because... Yeah. I don't know. I'd rather have that. It is 100 rupees. Okay, cool. Uh, and that will do it for this episode. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess, it'll be daytime, and we will cont continue with that side quest. And guess what? We'll have some story progression. Yay! I've been Xenobolt. I'll see you next time. Ciao.